This can be a hard problem to think about. I got the axis wrong myself when I was first making up this quiz. Drawing sketches helps. Remember that a vector rotating around an axis forms a circle. The cylinder's axis on the y-axis and the final axis through the corner of the cube define a circle whose center is at the origin. If you think about continuing this arc the whole way, it becomes pretty clear you're cutting the cube in half diagonally when viewed from above. We can also see that the axis through this circle is going to point in this direction or the opposite direction in order to be perpendicular to this slice. Since the y-axis is in this slicing plane, there won't be any y component in the coordinates for the axis of rotation itself. So this axis must be either x positive and z negative or x negative and z positive. For this reason, the second answer is correct. Negative x, z is the axis. There can only be one plane that contains the circle, and there is only one axis direction, or its opposite direction, that is perpendicular to this plane. Therefore, there is only one axis of rotation that will take us from our starting position to the corner of the cube. So we can rule out all three of the other answers.